Hello. Love. Welcome to another vlog. I'm starting this vlog off fresh on a Sunday night. Mm -hmm. And I'm having myself some wine. And some cheese hits until I get like really hungry and I'm gonna eat something, some real food. I'm gonna be working on another plan for one of my other friends, Kiana. This is her cute little planner. Look how cute it is from Barnes and Noble. I already made Michaela and Julia one. We'll see how they do. Hopefully they, it works for them. Um, I think so far so good. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna make one for Tiana because I know she wants to move out this year. So we're gonna make that happen. Or, or anyways, I have my well, it's basically two and a half weeks, but two weeks post-op appointment tomorrow. So we'll let y'all know how that goes. Everything's good so far. Date on like work stuff. I was in the well on Saturday, so I was just making drinks and stuff. It wasn't the best idea, but um, it wasn't terrible, but I did start to feel like really like exhausted and just sore. Cause, um, certain drinks that I make like muddling, it take a lot of like muscle, muscle usage. So I never realized how much your chest muscles play a part in like what you do with your hands. So yeah. Anyways, other than that, like everything's been good. Butter, you're so cute. Um, But yeah, Amazon sent me the wrong fucking water bottle again, the cheap version. So I'm just gonna literally, I ordered the cheaper version that literally is just like this and I'm gonna return the one that comes in because they're literally the same thing except the price difference is cut in half. Like this one was supposed to be the thin silver thing on there. Like it's supposed to be really thin and like, I don't know. They just keep sending me this one that has the thick silver bar. And it's not worth the $80 that I spent. Like it's, this shit's $30. So F you Amazon for that. I'm just gonna get the one, I'm just gonna use this one and return the other duplicate one for my money back. Anyways, I'm gonna get to working on this. Relax for a bit. I'm excited for my appointment tomorrow because all I want to do is hear that things are good. Like, I don't know, I'm just paranoid about like capsule, capsula contraction and stuff like that. And especially like from using my muscles on Saturday, my bad. Ooh. But yeah, we'll see how that goes. Fingers crossed, everything's good. They're gonna show me how to massage the breasts tomorrow so I can start getting them to like drop, which I feel like my right boob is dropped, but it's probably not, I don't know. I told you guys how I have pectus excavatum, so my chest wall case in, and it turned out to look really good for having pectus. But I think I do understand what he's saying now, cause my right boob is a lot lower than my left, but not by like a lot where it's like, oh my God. It's like maybe by like half a centimeter, or like a centimeter lower right now. But I can't remember for a good life of me if that's how it was out of surgery, that this one was already a smidge lower because if it was then they both still need to drop but i'm fingers crossing that this one's like in its place and this one just needs to drop because this one's like obviously very high up see that and this one looks already like natural and like dropped but it's not like as high up as this one like damn and yeah but i'll hope you guys update y'all on that and just see how tomorrow goes because i'm gonna ask them about it but anyways right now they're sisters not twins but they still look good i'm just really ocd so it bugs the crap out of me but i have to realize like boobies aren't perfect but i mean i'm paying for it so i don't know i guess i'll show you in another clip when i'm not super freaking tired with like a tighter shirt on or something what i mean by like the placement but they don't fully drop until six months, so I'm not gonna know till then anyways how they sit. So we'll see. Good morning, y'all. It's 10.30 and I slept way too much. I don't know why, I think my body's just like hit. But I remember slightly waking up and me stopping my alarm. But like, I don't know why I thought my alarm, I don't fucking know. But I did the thing again where I stopped my alarm and I just kept sleeping, which I haven't done in a while. So I think I've just been like, my body's just hit. But I gotta check my water. It's another disgusting rainy day. I gotta leave at like 12.30 to get to my appointment at two. <sighs> my whole face hurts right here because I literally slept way too much. I hate oversleeping, it's literally the fucking worst. Like it just feels tight and like blood is rushing everywhere here. definitely taste more coffee, coffee-ish, 
coffee-esque, coffee-like, you know? I don't know which one I like better. Starbucks one leaves an aftertaste, like coffee aftertaste. coast that gets like dark and groggy when daylight savings hits in the fall um because you don't experience it i hope you never do Sucks. i think i could be a really good actress if i actually tried i feel like i could easily fake cry you know what i don't know bro but another thing i've never had dandruff all my life until like a year ago or like this year not this year, a year ago. And I've been using head and shoulders and it's not working. It's just like making it worse. So I don't know what to do. I need to like look up with like actually good dandruff shampoos. Cause this shit's annoying. Like it's, there's so much dandruff. Like I'm telling you, that was rude. Anyways, what to do with my hair? The buzz, buzz. Buzz, what the buzz? One. Which is probably down to the hair. Using hair ties. I try not to use hair ties anymore, but. My signature perfume. I like your smell. The buzzes. well thank the lord they showed me on a massage um now i'm gonna have some subway before i hit the road because i have an hour drive and i had to eat ugh, all i had to eat today was chocolate chip waffles yeah i got a whole foot long just so i can have leftovers later I'm back my chair up i got turkey just turkey just kidding I got on an Italian bread, turkey, fresh mozzarella cheese, lettuce, tomato, cucumber, banana peppers, and pickles, and then honey mustard. Mm -mm. Yum. Tastes like summer. Hope this doesn't make me sleepy for the road back. I used to get subway all the time. Not all the time. But like in high school and stuff. I was growing up in general. And I love that they do like credit card tips now. Like tipping on the system. I feel like old me would have been like, what are we tipping for? Like, you're making a sandwich. But like, they are making a sandwich. And then, like I hate when I've had guests come to the bar for a drink. Like just a drink because they're waiting on a table. And they're like, oh, no tip. No need to tip. You're literally just pouring a drink. I literally just roll my eyes. I'm like, what the fuck is wrong with you? Huh? I literally cannot. We're just uneducated. And if you are, I'm educating you right now. You go to a bar, go to a restaurant, wherever you go, that you get service for a tip. Because at least 20% people only know about tipping. When it comes to like getting a haircut. You go out to eat, you're supposed to tip at least 15%, but 20% now I feel like is the new 15%. I never really crave sandwiches, but I forget how good they are. Mm -mm -mm. This is 
that real aloe shit that tastes actually good. I grew up on this. Yep, aloe, I don't know what they're doing, but this is delish. It's refreshing, it does have sugar in it. It's a good little snack. I love the um, jelly stuff in it. It's so refreshing. It kind of reminds me of lychee a little bit, but also not. I forget that the ceilings are high in this place because the cabinets kind of like stop short, so it looks like the place is like the ceiling ends there, but it really keeps going. Yeah! Damn. Oh, I really gotta organize. Every time I do my laundry, I'm like, shit, I need to organize this area, like, bloop. Precise. That's weird. I just did my implant massages for the first time. Well, they did it at the office. It feels so weird. It kind of hurts after a little bit, like it feels weird. But I'm guessing that's probably normal for like the first time doing that. So yeah. Also, I never realized this tank top was sheer. I would always wear no bra under it, but it probably didn't look sheer because I wasn't really stretching it up front. I'm like, bitch, what? No, I'm like, I'm doing this just mad see-through. It's seven o'clock and I'm gonna get ready to just moisturize my face and relax and then I go to bed. I'm using Kiehl's Creamy Eye Treatment. Clinique's moisturizing gel. Just one pump. I really need to start using the gua sha my friend Ashley got me. So I did get oil serum for it. But I will start doing that soon. I just think, I don't know, I just have not felt like doing it. And I use this before bed, but I'm just gonna put on some Vaseline. Anthropology candle lit. Making some instant noodles for a little nighttime before bed snack. Um, I've never tried this one before, but I just randomly saw it at the Asian supermarket. I don't know. Anybody know? But I'm gonna try it out. Toss packets in the bowl while I toss the noodles together. Is gonna die. Mm. Pretty good. Hey, y'all. Ready for the day. It's my day off, and it's my outfit. It's just this top from Shein, and then some jeans that I believe are a goldie. Yeah. Cute, she cute, she cute, she cute.
Ciao! Starbucks, how may I help you? Hi, can I have a venti iced matcha green tea latte with coconut milk and add vanilla? And you wanted a venti iced matcha latte with coconut milk? Mm -hmm. And add vanilla syrup. And add vanilla syrup. Mm -hmm. That's okay, it. Okay, that's it? Mm -hmm. Alright, if that's it and your total looks correct, you can drive on out. Thank you. Thank you. Um, yes, please. Thank you. Have a good day, thank you. You too. Good. I haven't had matcha in like forever. Yeah. Cheers. Let's see. Mmm. I forget how good this is. Delish. I do it with coconut milk. And I asked to add vanilla. So good. And so pretty. Yeah! Whoa! All right, I'm going to plan on getting my new laptop today. Excited. And. Mm. Delish. Anyways, I'm gonna go do that. And we'll set up the laptop together. Woo! What mail do I have right now? with it. Oh, that's so Connor. I wish I didn't have broccoli though. Chicken. For real, you gotta try it. Oh shit. Shit's hot. It's on fire. I always do that. Watch out, butter. Oh, I can eat this with pickles. Hey, Roxy. What are you doing? I got my laptop. I'm gonna open that up after I eat. And I got a little mouse for the cats just kidding lunch all right y'all mm -hmm. i'm gonna take my hair down for this nice and clean i'm to unbox my macbook Pro. i got the macbook Pro 14 inch M2, M1, my bad. 16 gigabyte, what the fuck is wrong with me? Um, 16 gigabyte memory and one TB SSD, AKA storage, which is what I need for video editing and all that jazz. I also want to work on music again, so yeah. Um, yay, I'm so excited, this is her. I got it in space gray. Let's say goodbye to the old, oldie baby. This I got, I think, in 2017. Mm -mm. This is a 13 inch. Bye, baby. I believe also in space gray. Um, it only has, I think, like 250 gigabyte storage. So I always have to like delete stuff in order to upload a new video. I don't know why though, because I don't really have anything on the computer, but well, I do have like Sims and like other stuff. I don't know. Anyways, let's open this baby. Oh, I also got this mouse. I didn't want to go and get the fancy Apple one, whatever. Like, I do not care. This show is $20. Okay. <sighs> okay. Ah! Oh, oh, okay. Wow. OMG. Okay. I'm going to keep this for memory now. So Y'all, I've been having like no energy this week and I think it's because I've been drinking less water as I was when I was post-surgery. Like I was drinking like three Britas a day and now I'm like barely drinking that much water and I think that's why I'm having a hard time waking up in the morning and blah, 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 blah. But I need to get back on that water grind. But I did feel really amazing. Like I was waking up early and yeah. Whoa. <gasps> wow, she's so pretty. Let's compare first before I really open her up. The size, honestly not bad. Like this is the difference 
which is amazing because I wanted the 13 inch, but they didn't have the um, same storage and stuff options. So I just got the 14 inch. Wow. Cool. What's that? Oh, that's pretty. It's like engraved. How cute. I'm gonna touch it. I love new electronic pieces. They're so cool. Ooh, she's so pretty. Wow. Look at that. Do a 360. Gorge. And then it has those plugs. Um, ooh, there's more plugs over here. Oh, there's an SD card slit. That's nice. Is this one? Let's compare. Honestly, this is like nice and round. Well, like, I don't know how to explain compared to this. Obviously the case is on, but this side only has a headphone jack and then just these two slots. So that's nice that there's like more options on each side. Not focusing, but whatever. Okay, now we're gonna open, open her up. This is pretty too, nice and shiny. I need to get a case on Amazon. Whoa. Oh my goodness, this is the best part. Ooh, hello. Pretty. I know, I'm probably giving everyone anxiety having this on the edge of the counter. Ooh, what else is in here while that loads? Um, little manual. Charger, nice. Charging cable, which this is cool. It's like this material, can you see? And that is all. Oops. Little wires. Apple's really appling up. Um, so I guess they're using this kind of charger now instead of the one that looks like this. I hate when the mouse moves mad slow. I'm gonna have to edit that in the setting. In my treat myself era, cause the past like year and a half, all I've been doing is pretending like I'm broke and put all my money away. And I haven't even gone clothes shopping in forever. The last time I recently just did was December and that wasn't even like enough. Mac but contains a what the fuck up? Anyways. So I'm in my big treat myself era. I got myself titties. I got myself a new MacBook Pro. Obviously these are gonna be lasting me a very long time. So it's worth the investment. And I think I'm gonna invest in a new, like a really good video editor because I love video editing and iMovie sucks. Like it's mad boring. All right, I'm gonna set up my laptop and transfer everything over so I can give Tiana my old laptop. Okay, I think I finally figured out how to reset this. It's from 2017, so it doesn't have like that um, like the setting for where you hit like system settings restart so I just hit restart or reset I, meant. I hit restart and then how to hit command R Ready. I'm gonna order a case for it on Amazon and it has a cool like finger ID watch yeah um yeah I'm about to get Final Cut Pro so hi so I got my laptop set up and I gave Tian my laptop and finally got a reset. <laughs> um, so now I'm taking a little breaky break before I start editing this vlog. I'm so excited to edit because I finally got Final Cut Pro. Obviously I need to learn how to use it, but I'm a pretty quick learner when it comes to like editing things. So, but right now I have my baby Coke. Remember I bought a bunch of baby Cokes for my surgery, but turns out I shouldn't have been drinking them. So I didn't drink them after surgery. And now I need to get rid of them and I don't even drink soda so I'm trying to drink one at a time. They're literally so tiny. So it takes like four sips and you can finish it. Oh, anyways, oh my God, dude, this is the third time I saw 222, hold on. So the first time literally was when we were resetting the laptop for Tiana, then saw it again somewhere, literally like 10 minutes after that. And now I'm seeing it again. Wow, and I got the last of that ramen noodle that I showed y'all. It's actually really good. Okay, and I'm gonna watch a YouTube video and relax. Hi, right, y'all, we's in my bathroom. Um, I'm gonna end this vlog off now because I think I got a bunch of footage, but we'll see how this vlog is. But I wanna be more on top of like cool editing like I want to have more fun with my editing because I used to love editing my videos when I used to make videos for fun in middle school and like beginning of high school so that's the goal so let's see what I can do with Final Cut Pro but yeah it's gonna take me some time to learn and find the way that I like to edit so 
but I'm excited. Are you excited? You better be. And you better be subscribed. So click the button below. And thank you so much for watching. Love you guys. I'll probably do a booby update in the next vlog. How about that? Love you.